rest up day and I'm going to my room. You do that? I know where you live. So does Nathan. Maybe I shouldn't have done that. Now I have to get to my room, then see Warren. Sorry. That's an awesome cashmere coat. It was. But there'll be another. Well, you always seem to know how to pick the right outfits. Awesome. I do have some talent. Mr. Jefferson told me. I've seen your pictures. You have a great eye. Richard Avedon-esque. He's one of my heroes. Thanks, Max. I enjoyed watching that. I hope those sluts get me a towel before they hang a sign on me. You deserve a better shot. Sorry about blocking you and and the go fuck your selfie. Aw, okay. That was me, but pretty funny. Just one of those days, you know? I know exactly what you mean, Victoria. I'll see you later. Au revoir. Victoria probably played me. I should have. No. Seemed okay. There's no play there. There's no play. Um. I don't know how long I'm going to stream tonight. We'll see. Not very long. Go, Miss Grant. Not sure if I will, though. I'm a loser. Yeah. Victoria. Room 217? So no way in hell am I ever going in here. Two shining references in one go. Is this a Vortex Club or a Victoria Club initiation? Truly pathetic. Juliet, extreme reporter. Dane is still a cheerleader at heart. This girl must have been popular. She's everywhere. Juliet, extreme reporter. Could be fun. Glad I'm not the only lonely nerd around here. I like Ursula Kayla Gwynn. Can I be a geek girl? Girl? Thanks for the warning. At least that's an alarm from this century. Looks like nobody won this TP war. There's nothing left but ghosts. They live. <laughs> How sad. I didn't write anything. I have nothing to say. Home sweet home, my favorite cocoon. Oh, we get solos? Oh my god, this school is amazing. 
I love that mom sent me a fat box of chocolate coconut bites for my birthday. And slipped in a $200 gift certificate. She sure knows how to make a sad birthday happy. Thanks, Principal Dickhead. Principal Ratface. Don't appreciate that at all. Warren even left me a little message with his flash drive. He's such a goofball. Hard to believe I'm 18. Do I look any older? Just more stressed. The Max Caulfield Photo Memorial Wall. Ahoy, Captain. At least I know you've got my back. When I swallowed your eye and my parents rushed me to the ER, I knew we were bonded forever. So cheesy, but it makes me smile thinking of the day Mom and I sewed that together. She likes it a certain time, so. <sighs> Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. The longer I wait, the worse it'll be. Idiot. Cartier Bresson, Doino, Hamilton, the greatest. That's the only tourist picture I let them take of me at the Space Needle. That was a good hockey game and a great fight. Man, Kristen and Fernando were so drunk hanging on the Fremont Troll. Philip Lorca de Corsha, my man. I don't think I could take my camera to those places. Look at that shot. I love Julia Cameron's Victorian vibe. Talk about analog cameras. Ah, oh, Dolly, what a fantastic eye. He could truly freeze time. Max and Chloe, best friends forever. Who even says that anymore? <coughs> I'm going to have to call Chloe eventually and find out what she'll say. One day I'll organize my film collection. One day I'll get an actual HD TV. If I'm not looking through a viewfinder, I'm looking through a window. Always looking. I'm glad Kate let me borrow her copy of The October Country. Instant film is so damn hard to find and expensive now. It's such a pretty guitar. I need to play it more. Play it now. Hard to believe I'm 18 now. I'm lucky my parents enabled my photo habit into adulthood. guitar. It is. this is that supposed to be the catcher in the rye <laughs> looks just like the catcher in the rye cover hold on
Okay. I love my... Would Man Ray call them selfie portraits? Okay. I'll miss going to the games with my dad. Go Thunderbirds. Thunderbirds. I am so addicted to this site. Look at these vintage beauties. Warren makes me laugh. It's nice to feel like I already made a real friend here. Looks like Dana left me a little post-it note. Great. Now I have to go get the flash drive from Dana's room. You can't get out now, Dana. So tell me the truth or rot in there. Welcome to the real drama queens of Blackwell. Oh, Victoria, give me a fucking break. <laughs> Warren should be all over Brooke. They're perfect for each other. Let me help Juliet. This is so stupid. Hey, Juliet. Is everything cool? Oh, yes, Max. I've locked Dana in the room because we're cool. God, the character models are shit. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ooh. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Oh, shit. Uh, Juliet Mason. That was truly sad. Thanks for your concern, Max Caulfield. By the way, Juliet Watson. Hey, Ju Oh, yes, Max. Hey, I've locked Dana. So stupid. What did she do? What didn't she do? Dana's been sexting with my boyfriend. Ouch. How did you find out? Uh, why do you care? Why are you even asking me? You never talk. Just zone out with your camera. That's why I'm talking to you now. What's my last name? Juliet Watson. Duh. I'm flattered. I didn't even think you knew my name at all. Of course I do. Just because I don't talk about doesn't shallow? mean I don't care. Mm. You don't know my name. So mm. how did you find out Just, about that? Come on. It's According okay. to Victoria, Dana would do anything to date a quarterback. According to Victoria, huh? She saw the sext, and Zachary won't answer his phone. Once Dana admits it, she can go straight to hell. Max, I swear I didn't do anything, but I bet Victoria did. I know the proof is in her room. I'll give Victoria props for not posting my photo. And for this nice Boom! This is the email I need to show Juliet. Now I have to print this fast and get the hell out of here. better convinced Juliet that Dana is in 